What is up YouTube, Cruise Designs here, and today I've got a Cinema 4D tutorial. Now in this video, we're going to be learning how to wrap text or um, bend text. It's a really cool effect, uh, particularly for backgrounds. So let's get started. Obviously, we're going to grab some text. You want to type out what you want your text to be. So I'll have Cruise. We're going to align it in the middle and then uh, create a bit of depth. I'm going to use 85 and then change the font and I'll use that font, uh, Autumn. And I'm also going, uh, if your font is quite close together, then you're going to want to pull the horizontal spacing up a bit. So I'm going to pull mine up to uh, 5 there you go and you can also add your fillet cap there we go so we've got our text and now we want to bend it so to bend the text uh, you want to come to the uh, deformers menu up here and then come down to wrap and at first it won't do anything you need to drag the wrap uh, the wrap deformer down onto the text and you'll see it's already started to bend it so obviously this is way too much uh, we wouldn't be able to use this for anything really uh, unless it was an intro animation so we need to make uh, we need to lessen the bend so here are the options, we've got width, height and radius. Now the two we really want to focus on are width and radius. You'll see if I change the width, that changes the amount of bend, that will uh, squish it together. And radius uh, increases how, uh, how stretched the text is. So I'm going to pull the radius up a bit and then put the width up a bit to there and that's looking not too bad you need to play around with these settings get it just how you want it and I think that is just about there so I've got my width on 1050 and my radius on 380 so we can also add a material, just double click in the material palette. I'm just going to create a simple red. Add some reflection. And then change the specular. Drag that onto the text. And then I'm going to render this out. And there you have it. We've got the uh, bendy text. So obviously uh, you need to put some lighting in and get that looking really cool. But that's the end of the tutorial. So I hope this is helpful. It is a really cool effect. Uh, it's not used on many backgrounds. I don't know why because it really does give them a unique feature. And it's pretty easy to do. So this is Cruise Designs. I hope this tutorial was helpful. Please comment, rate and subscribe. And I'll see you in the next video. Thanks for watching.